Capital Blue Cross Brain Busters. I'm here with News Ace Lori Burkhalter, and we played our opening round, if you're just joining us. Cumberland Valley has a slight lead of 100 to Lancaster Country Days 40, but everything can change. And, and I'm here live with News Ace Lori Burkhalter. Lori, that music was awesome. Dance, yeah. That was the Lancaster Country Day School uh, Jazz Ensemble under the direction of They're Mr. Wonderful. Kenny Townsend. Great music tonight yeah. from both of our schools. Absolutely wonderful. You know, we want to know a little bit more about these teams, right, and how they get ready for a big night like tonight, because a lot of schools wanted to be here, Rich. Well, you, you know? really got a taste of what they're like behind the scenes. We did. We spent a little time with each team. Now, Cumberland Valley has been here before. They were on the stage, what, two years ago? Two years ago, yes. Didn't snag the big prize, but they're thinking they're going to do it this year, and there's one team member, the original team member, he's back to claim the big prize. Take a look at what he thinks is the secret to winning. Okay. This is Brain Buster's practice at Cumberland Valley High School, filled with friendly jabs and, of course, quizzing. They're a smart bunch. After all, the senior class valedictorian is on the team. Oh, best subjects, um, science by far. Actually, um, every uh, before every match, I do a uh, LeBron James style, pick up the chalk and go like this. Every match, no. <laughs> that energy keeps Coach Donna Benson on her toes. They have a wide variety of knowledge, and they surprise me sometimes keep you on your toes. Yeah, they, they give me a heart attack every now and then too when they when they don't answer what I think they're going to do, but that happens. This team is no stranger to the finals. The outcome wasn't in their favor last time. Now they're looking to change that. Uh, we have a strong team. I think we, we've got four very talented kids in a lot of different subjects. We work together well and I, we just we just know the stuff. Team captain Michael Liu is the only returning member of this team, and he's standing by his old tradition. So from now, from that point on, th that's my excuse for showing up late to the tapings. That one time where I showed up early, I didn't have a good match. So I don't know if it's true or not, but yeah, it works. Like their rivals, Cumberland Valley is hoping for extra support from family and friends, like their fellow Latin classmates, who prepared this cheer. There's going to be a lot of uh, friends and family there watching. It's uh, support your school. Just make everyone proud, hopefully. And you know, we're happy to report that Michael Lou made it on time, right, Mike? He is here on time at the Whitaker Center. Of course, now there's another team that's battling it out here tonight at the Whitaker Center. That's, of course, Lancaster Country Day. First year, by the way, for their quiz bowl team, and they made it all the way to the final. So congratulations to them, and here's why they're ready to battle. Yes. Ellen Clackey is a year younger than her three teammates, and she's also the only girl. I spend more time thinking about what I'm going to wear, probably, but um, other than that, it's not that big of a deal. She's nursing a broken leg, an injury from a soccer game. It's actually, it's kind of nice because I can't, you know, go for a run, I can't play soccer, I can't, you know, do dance class, so this is one of the ways that I can still compete. The team gets pumped up for competitions, but say level heads got them to the finals. We've been uh, fairly relaxed about the entire process. You might notice that we're never in uniforms, so to speak. We very seldom wear jackets, um, sometimes not even ties. Why so laid back? This is the first year for Lancaster Country Day's team, and they had no idea what to expect. I, th I think, you know, when we first started this, we were kind of expecting this just to be, you know, kind of a fun thing, maybe go one or two rounds. They made it through those first two rounds and kept going all the way to the championship. And now that they've reached the finals, each player is brushing up on their favorite subjects. Cultural, sports movies, and kind of newer knowledge. Literature, sometimes history questions. History and politics. Um, math, on the other hand, I, you're not going to see me answering many math questions. I leave that to a uh, my teammate. It's a toss-up. You know, Jonathan, Ellen, Noah, Nate, any of them could get it. Everybody on our team is a generalist. Coach Jeremy Williams says he's going into the final ready for battle. Nuntiamus victoriam um, it is, it is, is, my, is my slogan. Um, all, all the kids pick up on it. It means let us declare victory. Dr. Jeremy Williams, of course, here with us, coach for the Lancaster Country Day. And also we have Donna Benson here from Cumberland Valley. It's funny, when you said that comment at the end, I could hear people out there going, what's that? We asked the same thing, but that's your motto, right? All, all my students recognize it. It's in big letters on, <laughs> on the whiteboard, and they get, some of, they, they get some of the side comments that go, go along with it. You declare, you, you declare victory yes. ju when, 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 you fin when you finish. There is, there is no such thing as defeat. Well, I, knew, I noticed there, when we were visiting you with our cameras at your school, there was a book that you were opening up. What, how were you studying for this final, for this competition? Um, there's, a, there's a standard publisher that 
um, when my sister did this in high school in Ohio, her team always used, and so one of the first things I looked up was the same publisher. So okay. their, their standard quiz book. All right. Well, your team, obviously, first year for your Quiz Bowl team, made it all the way to the finals. Congratulations. And also Donna Benson here. Your team gives, gives you a heart attack on a regular basis? Occasionally. <laughs> occasionally. Although, hey, I have to tell you, they're sharp dressers. Tonight. Everybody's a sharp dresser, but I notice all the black shirts yeah, and the, the ties. ties look great. Yeah. yeah, they're very nice guys, by the way. So tell me, tell me a little bit about your team here and what you're expecting out of them and how they're doing so far. Well, I think they're doing very well, and the excitement here is fabulous. It's just really helping, I think, build all of the excitement for the end. Yeah, they're up now a little bit. We got 100 to, what do we have now, to 40. So they're up a little bit. Plenty of time, though, left, by the way, guys, in the show. But So obviously, they're making some headway. Yes, we're very happy about that. Let's win. <laughs> yeah, OK. Any final comments to your team? Well, it's only half the deficit. We, we were behind by last time, so. Yep. There's hope. There is a, a plenty of time left in the show. You know what? We got a lot to get to. So thanks, coaches, for coming out. Good talking to you. Get to know your team. Rich, send it over to you. Lori, thanks a lot. That was really fun. You know, to get to this point in our competition, Cumberland Valley High School and Lancaster Country Day, both of those teams had to play against some impressive competition. The championship final of Capital Blue Cross Brain Busters live for Whit from Whitaker Center for Science and the Arts continues in just a short moment. But first, let's take a look at the 48 other teams that competed at Studio A at WGAL this season. Capital Blue Cross and WGAL 8 salute the high school teams that competed this season on Capital Blue Cross Brain Busters. Donegal, Central Dauphin East, Spring Grove, Bishop McDevitt, Boiling Springs, J.P. McCaskey, Harrisburg Academy, Hempfield, Governor Mifflin, Mannheim Township, Camp Hill, Elko, Steelton High Spire, Bermudian Springs, Elizabethtown, Wilson, Blue Mountain, Mechanicsburg, Redland, Biglerville, Warwick, Lower Dolphin, Milton Hershey, Susquehanna, Gettysburg, Trinity, Susquehanna Township, Lampeter Strasburg, New Oxford, Chambersburg, Hershey, Conestoga Valley, Penn Manor, Big Spring, SciTech, Southwestern, West Perry, Hanover, Carlisle, Exeter, Northern, Lebanon Catholic, Middletown, Schuylkill Valley, Lancaster Catholic, Cedar Cliff, Dallas Town, Cedar Crest. Capital Blue Cross Brain Busters will return following these messages.